Once upon a time, in a jungle so incredibly vast and teeming with life that even the leaves seemed to whisper secrets, lived Tarzan, the undisputed king of the jungle. His realm was a labyrinth of towering trees, their branches entwined like the fingers of giant hands, and emerald canopies so dense they swallowed the sky. Yet, for all his mastery over this lush wilderness, Tarzan was on the verge of encountering something or someone that would baffle even his boundless knowledge. One mystical day, as Tarzan was swinging from vine to vine, each swing a fluid dance with the wind, he heard an unfamiliar sound. Hello? Hello? It was neither the majestic trumpet of an elephant nor the playful chatter of monkeys. <laughs> The sound was different, alien, a gasping cry of distress Hello. that sliced through the jungle air like a knife. Ah, uh, ew! Who trespasses in my hidden world? Tarzan bellowed, his voice echoing like thunder, while his eyes, sharp as an eagle's, scanned the verdant maze below. Then he saw her, Jane, her golden hair cascading like a waterfall of sunlight, her eyes round orbs of wonder and apprehension. She looked utterly out of place, like a star plucked from the night sky and dropped into the deep forest. Who are you? Jane asked, trembling as she caught sight of Tarzan descending gracefully from his leafy perch. I am Tarzan. He declared with a proud thump on his chest. King of this endless Eden. And you are an intruder in my kingdom. Explain yourself. I'm so sorry. I'm lost. My name is Jane. She stammered. I don't know how to get back to where I came from. Staring into her eyes, Tarzan felt a strange sensation in his chest, as if a dormant seed had suddenly sprung to life, yearning to burst into bloom. This feeling was mysterious, unlike any he'd felt before, and it puzzled him. Very well. He finally spoke. I shall guide you, but promise me you will not disturb the harmony of my jungle. I promise. Jane replied, relief and gratitude shining in her eyes like morning dew. Thus began an adventure that melted two disparate worlds. Tarzan showed Jane the hidden wonders of his domain, the talking parrots, the dancing fireflies, and the azure lakes reflecting the heavens. Jane, in turn, told Tarzan about her faraway world, teeming with strange customs, sprawling cities, and vast oceans. However, trouble was brewing. Word reached Kala, a malevolent gorilla who harbored a deep, festering envy towards Tarzan. Seething with jealousy and malice, Kala signed Jane a tool to undermine his rival. One fateful night, when the moon was veiled behind ominous clouds as if anticipating something terrible, Kala decided to strike. Tarzan and Jane were resting beside a waterfall, its cascade a misty veil, when the villainous gorilla leapt from the shadows. Tarzan, look out! Jane's shriek shattered the night's eerie silence. Leaping like a bolt of lightning, Tarzan met Kala in a mid-air collision. They tumbled, a whirlwind of snarls and fists, each vying for control. It felt like an epic battle, one that would decide the fate of their intertwined lives and the jungle itself. Finally, with a maneuver as swift as it was daring, Tarzan swung a vine around Kala's legs, tripping him and sending him sprawling into a web of tightly knit vines. Kyla, your treachery has no place in this jungle. Leave and never return. Tarzan roared, his voice tinged with both triumph and disappointment. Dejected and beaten, Kala slinked away into the blackened depths of the forest, never to be seen again. Turning to Jane, Tarzan's eyes softened. Are you unharmed, Jane? I am, thanks to you, Tarzan, she said, her voice trembling like a fragile leaf in the wind. 
Their eyes met and, in that brief moment, both knew that their worlds had been forever altered. With their hearts pounding like the frenzied drumbeats of a tribal dance, they swung away into the jungle's mysterious depths, embracing whatever astonishing adventures awaited them. So, dear children, in that far-off realm where magical realism reigns and the laws of nature bend to the whims of love, Tarzan and Jane found their happily ever after. And the jungle, well, it continued to murmur its age-old secrets, but now with a new tale to tell, one of love, courage, and everlasting friendship.